We who are each of us should please our neighbors for their good to build them up. For even Christ did not please himself, but it is written, The insults of those who insult you have fallen on me. For everything that was written in the past was written to teach us, so that through the endurance taught in the scriptures and the encouragement they provide, we might have hope. May the God who give endurance and encouragement give you the same attitude of mind towards each other that Christ Jesus had, so that with one mind and one one voice you may glorify the God and the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, accept one another. Then, just as Christ accepted you, in order to bring praise to God, for I tell you that Christ has become a servant of the Jews on behalf of God's truth, so that the promises made to the patriarchs might be confirmed, and moreover, the Gentiles might glorify God for his mercy, as it is written. Therefore, I will praise you among the Gentiles. I will sing the praises of your name. Again, it says, Rejoice, you Gentiles, with his people. And again, Praise the Lord, all you Gentiles. And all the people extol him. And again, Isaiah says, The root of Je Jesse will spring up one who will rise to rule over the nations. In him, the Gentiles will hope. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him, so you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit.